ine zina langa ni negridi thirongo. Choke la pamuzi pamchacha. Diponso pana wera kuno na bure ya programu ya stage ya somba kani ya padamu. Diponso program pia yamba ya padamu. Te karao kondwera te wantu. Ndalume wangu akaruta kusomba. Diponsa kawela. Tunga onkalo guri sa wana schoolu nzio sauka. Dipona mene ne na ne nzio sauka. Ko malomba pa. Mtendele wawele pa nyumba pa tu. Nika pita na wewe jenga tina lore zaidi au tia si panga gua somba kujia. Kuma zinka gua somba zija. Nika guri sa. Nika guri sa. Entenga ndrama zija. Kanja kama ni kani sora kunyumba. Dipito kagura. Zina singuli sa songs 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 zija yai zina siya inga siya ko nuzan zan gama ke ah ah yami ichitani pamoto yami yani kani songs zija wakaya nika mujani ya kare zina basu nugodula ko mukamtondo nuvulu ya kupala apasi ni wana uchia uti paliwe na wana meswa kani isa kujerwa minga the world we find for nature. Uh, has been working on a project called GIZ Fish for Food in the Eastern Province since 2021. The project focuses on the sustainable management of fisheries and uh, small water bodies uh, in the Eastern Province with the main focus on the 11 dams. The aim of the project is to promote core management approaches involving communities, traditional leaders, local government and local authorities government departments, women, youths, and the value chain actors. Uh, the project um, focuses on uh, ensuring that we put in place the management plans on how these small water bodies can be managed. So the first, we have two dams in, in Nyimba, sitting in Chifundake, that's Kalambakua and Malipa. We have one dam in Petauke, which is Rosowe, sitting in Chief, Senior Chief Kalindawaro. We have two dams in Katete, that is Bikoko and Mtambo, sitting in Chief Mbangombe. We have one dam in Kasenengwa district, in Chief Madzimawe. We have three dams in Chipangari, two are in Chief Chanje, that is Maparandrokuje. Then we have one in Chief Sairi, stroke Chief Chinunda, that's Lumamba Dam. We have also two dams in Lundazi. Both are sitting in Chief Mpamba, but we also engage a Chief Kapichira because um, the beneficiaries also include some of the villages from Chief Kapichira. Sustainable fisheries management is actually key to the department of fisheries in particular because whatever we do as a department, we want to enhance fish availability at all levels. So sustainable fisheries is actually very key at community level because it does away with the poverty, also promotes income generation, and also some local employment is generated within the local communities. Omoyo wanga ine naone ya tichi inja. Chifu kwa nezo salira kuli vambili. Kwa mathuru mapuziro vambili nambo ziba manja. Vanezo salira ako, nso mba tenzo kungo gwila cha bechi sawa wa stenzo ziba utizi nso mba kai vena nguwezo gwila na mapai seteka. Tenzo gwila na mapawa neti. Stenzo ziba utika pena neti ya nefuni kukashi wa nso mba nisaizi guanji stenzo ziba kuma this time unu ziba utaa. Neti ya nefuni kukiri wa nso mba ni tuwe ndi hafu. Then the mosquito net is already to be built and so on. The funiga manet, the jamene yoro zebra, build and so on by command. The satin net, the jamene na le zebra, mami ya mula build and so on by, the jasud mo sama la kujai mo ono. So as one be the mazi ga funiga net, the yoro zebra, command so boat. Oh, isepa, tapa na sewe no. 
The GIZ Fish for Food project has also brought in the government approach of multi-sectorial approach where not just one department must focus on this work, but several departments must come together to enhance, implement, and uh, tackle a particular aspect which is community-based and which is um, a welcomed and brings impact on the community. From the initial phase, the training, Putting up of uh, the management committee, I think now we are getting uh, a positive reports from uh, Makungwa Dam because what was there initially was uh, lawlessness. People would do, use any methods of fishing, even unconventional methods, usage of uh, mosquito nets and other things. So with the coming of uh, this program, I think uh, we have uh, now, I think, uh, managed to realize the importance of that facility. So when it is properly managed as it is now, that is like a vehicle which needs servicing. So if you don't service it, then one day it will collapse and that will be the end of it. The project has, uh, has promoted uh, the co-management approaches by ensuring that the stakeholders that are responsible for managing the dam, managing the fish in the dam. So in this case, we, we have worked with the Department of Fisheries, the Department of Agriculture, Department of Forest and also the Water Resource Development uh, Office in the Eastern Province. So we have so far uh, disseminated and or rolled out uh, several trainings that includes leadership, financial management, active citizenship, inclusive development, working together with the Zambian Governance Foundation. We have also further uh, done the trainings with the Department of Water Resource Development in uh, dam maintenance and operation to the communities through the dam management committees. So, Chitukuko, Chiwela Kuno, Nikambako Pyorela Mudamu, Mudamu Iruta, Mudamu 2021, March. Nikopa Nukatiri, Kapunzila Makunziro, Nyepeche Nakuti Mweo, Kuliga Nakuti Mudamu Iruta. So, Mungo, Chitukuko Chan, Chichomunga Fune, Kutu Munga Tandizike. Oyamba, Etiretela, Shera, Ya Kaskinya Kasalati, Etiretela. Nani, <laughs> Nkuringa naramu na mene inga karepa katundu. So damu yatu hii, umbu yoku, la muno kwene kwene kuna haribi. So kuringa na mene wabukira kuma bungu na ise, community kuna tinachifu wa mene sandi, nao wana kuta achinjo, ilipo. Nga karelo mba uponya, uponya poku wa mpipa damu natu, nga pita tisomba, zikuru, zikuru kwa buwe. Kuma kumbu yoku, zima kareti saizi mene yae. So ndiyo chinjo wa mene ningaone po ine, kuringa na chinjo kwa damu natu.